morning and welcome back. We're here at the Balanced Pan-Asian Grill in Maumee, Ohio. And we're sitting here with CJ, AKA Chef Banger. Hi. Is that correct? Yes. How are you doing this morning? I'm doing great, how are you? I'm doing great. And we're here to talk about the concept from everything from the name to the food to the atmosphere. So one of the first things we're gonna start off with is the name Balance. Yes. Please explain to me how that became the, one of the concepts to opening your business. Well, me and my business partner, PK, have been wondering you know, what to call our restaurant. We definitely want to do something that fits the name and the type of food that we that we sell and the branding as well behind it. And when we were thinking about our food that we serve, there was definitely a good balance of the, the proteins, the carbs, the veggies, all the nutrients that's that is a must in everyone's health, you know. So what we thought about was if we use you know 50% carbs and 25% proteins and veggies that incorporates all those nutrients together, it was a perfect balance of a meal. So, and, and also in our sauces, which is our main thing that we really like to push is the sauces because everything is uh, homemade and we make everything from scratch. And it's the sauce that makes the whole difference in our meal. So, in our sauces, there's a good balance of spice, flavor, you know, like saltiness, the, the garlic and all that. And then at, at the end, the end result is a, a, a good balance of all palate of flavors that brings it all together. So we thought about, how about the name balance? And you know, it's like, you know what? That's, that fits right around the corner, you know? So that's what we went with. You took the concept of Asian or Chinese food mm -hmm. and you put a, your twist on it to make it urban and upscale. Right. So explain to us how you did not also for making it fresh, but just keeping it there. Right. I mean, concept is very uh, important. I mean, it's, it is a restaurant uh, after all, but food is definitely one of the things that's very important, you know, quality of food and the taste. But at, behind it, you got to have a solid branding and concept as well. And it seems like around this area, especially in the Toledo area, it seems like there's a, a stereotype when it comes to uh, like a typical Chinese or mom and pop right. restaurant. They already assume that it's they're all the same, and you know that they all taste the same, the quality is low, and things like that. And I wanted to step outside that box and introduce this area something that's you know that's catching on in other states and uh, all over the world really. And it's a fast casual setting, which is still fast. You know, you're served fast right. under five minutes but you get the better quality compared to a fast food chain. Definitely so, a big difference. I mean, everything that we make in the house all comes as whole foods. We prep everything in the house, and you can see it through our glass, you know, that all the veggies are cut daily on a daily basis. All the meat is prepped, you know, fresh daily, and all of our sauces are made daily as well. That's so I'm gonna talk about is. my favorite part of the restaurant, which you may be surprised about, is the bathrooms. <laughs> if you have not, not been surprised. in those bathrooms, right. This is like the serene part of the restaurant where we are, but the bathrooms, yes. you got to share. I could be spending all I mean, day in there. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure you agree with us. I mean, when you go to a bathroom in a public setting, it's usually pretty dirty. And, yes. and, and you don't really want to do anything in there but to wash your hands and get right out. You know? Right. And I mean, definitely when it comes to a restaurant, my mom even, she's a restaurant owner as well. And every time you ask a, a, a restaurant owner, you judge a restaurant's cleanliness by the look of their bathroom. Mm -hmm. Yes. I mean, from smell to the looks, you know, and we always pay a lot of attention to the cleanliness of the bathroom. I always have my employees clean there constantly. And we wanted to be artistic, you know, I mean, it's a, it's a bathroom, you know, and, and why not add a little, some flair to it, just to make it, you know, make the customers feel a little more comfortable using it. And, you know, there's a, there's a reason for it, and we, you know, we wanted to bring in the youth part of our, our, our business, you know, and we'd like to um, incorporate my, my guys that I know like um, a tattoo artist that actually did most of our work, and I, you know, I asked him. I was like, "You want to, you know, put some work on this, you know?" And he was definitely totally down to he do it. He did a phenomenal job. You've got to go. He is great. Before you order your food, go to the back. <laughs> yeah, check it out for sure. It's, Wash your hands. It's, it's a little different. more than just a bathroom <laughs> right. toilet, you know. So yeah. well, let me ask you one more question, just for our viewers sure. out there. If you're coming in and you're very health conscious, is there anything on the menu that you would advise or? maybe even suggest more than any others. I know the brown rice, let right. me tell you, the brown rice is excellent here. That's, that's when our name comes along again, balance. Um, when, it's, when I mean by balance too, we don't like to just be known as just, oh, we're ultra healthy and that's all we offer, you know? We also like to uh, cater towards the, the customers that 
that are into, you know, some guilty pleasures, you know what I mean? Once a week kind of thing, you know? <laughs> that's how we still offer bread and chicken, you know? You, everybody knows, it's common sense. Everybody knows that fried is not as healthy as fruit. Right. And we also still have fried rice, because it's, which is a classic menu. Right. And I can't get rid of that. And noodles. Food. That's and, big with and kids. And those are killer sellers, you know? Right. And that's why we always have options for everybody. For like healthy, that. conscious people who constantly work out and watch their figure, yeah, you should definitely get grilled chicken and brown rice, you know, with all the veggies. Right. Like Wiseman. Well, would you let our viewers know if they want to learn more about you or PK? Yes. Where, where can they go? Well, we're very tech-savvy people, so we like to do a lot of our marketing and, you know, announcements all through Twitter. So you can follow us at Balance Girl, you know, and then we also have a Facebook page, which we're very, Excellent. you know, very um, into. And um, always visit our website, www. Balancegrill.com. So okay. that would be the best ways to uh, get a hold of us. And then we have two locations, obviously. So one in Maumee at the Boulevard, um, corner of Ford and Dustin. Okay. And then we have a, our newest location on corner of Holland, Savannah, and Central Avenue. So there's one important thing I almost yes. forgot to bring up with you, and that is while we're talking about how great things are mm -hmm. about the restaurant, the restrooms, yeah. the cost. The cost factor is also very, yes. very. We make it affordable. Very, it I mean, affordable. It's, it's flat, six dollars for a bowl. So if I want, if I want shrimp, it's what? It's six dollars. If I want the chicken, six dollars. So it's no yeah, trick. Steak, brown rice, white rice, it doesn't I matter. I get broccoli, flat. no matter what, six dollars. Exactly, exactly. Excellent. And you could always do double meat, which is extra, but. And, and our meals cost is less as four dollars. Right now we're running a um, seasonal special for a wrap. I mean, it's a big, decent sized wrap, and yes, it started at four dollars. So, it and even go, the um, when I get when I get a container, it is enough for two people. Yeah, I mean it's a, it's a, it's a decent sized box. It, it so is a lot in there. It a normal, average person up real quickly. So, well, we thank you for coming to the show thank and you sharing for with me. us. We hope that the viewers there will come out to Balance Bureau and check out what it's all about. I promise you enjoy the experience. But don't go away, because after the break, Teresa and I are going to be hitting the kitchen, and we're going to be putting together a great meal that you can make at home.